I know what you're probably thinking. I know you're thinking, those fishnets don't do your figure any justice. Well, sounds a lot better than what my father would say. So what you think? Heard about the new black? Ha! Huh? What's Alda shouting for? Ooh. Cute nails, Ma. Are you serious? Her son's here sitting here painting his nails. And all you can say is they're cute. Robert, there are lads Mark's age pillaging and raping the way through Dublin. You should feel proud that all your son does experiment with a little of his mother's nail varnish. We can't deal with this. We're going to walk. I've always wondered what a pair of tits not made from a packet of penny socks would actually feel like. Uh, no. <laughs> Wouldn't my dad love to hear that? Say. And the lads are gonna slag the bollocks out of me. Uh, maybe it's just a face. I mean, I'll surely grow out of it. Guys, it's not as if I want to look like Kim or anything. I mean, the absolute effort all of that takes. I guess I just like the idea of being someone else for the day. And it just so happens that that someone else is a pair of tits. And I reckon 50% of people who see me think that I want to change, you know, my bits. But I guess they just don't know the true line between drag queen and full-blown woman. I don't understand this. I mean, how do, you, how do I work this? Help me out, love, will you? <laughs> I think what your, Mark, what your father is trying to say is <laughs> he would like to know whether or not you would like to um, alter your unmentionables. Mark, can we? In my line of work, acceptance doesn't always come easy. I mean, even though I think I look six foot one and fabulous, a lot of Dublin's uneducated would disagree. What's the matter with you? This is someone who did this to you. Just leave it alone, Dad. It doesn't matter. I want names, son, and I want them now. Who did this to you? 
Tell me. Lads, down the road. Nobody puts their hands on an O'Reilly. Nobody! Even if they're... Right. Stick on my teeth. sending you to your debts. Obviously this isn't what we had in mind, but we're so proud of you, whether you wear a dress or a tux. <laughs> oh God, it's fantastic. Before I forget. So in life, you can be fucked, or you can be fabulous. And always, and I mean always, be fabulous. Because to quote RuPaul, we're all born naked. The rest is just drag. <laughs>